Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be um, pulling a Michael Vick in the Madden Mover set from the garage sale. So before I do that, I'm going to have to get some more Madden tape. So I'm going to go to this Mover set. It says I can get 2000 from doing this World Traveler. So I'm going to do that. So here's the set I'm going to complete for that. Let's complete this. And we just got the World Traveler, which should give us enough to get Michael Vick. And we also got this new offensive guard, which I actually update my team with. So we're going to get Michael Vick now. Like this. And there, we just got Michael Vick. My first Onyx card, my first 100 overall card. So let's, let's put him in our team. So right now I have uh, Russell Wilson. Let's see how he compares. Oh, he's a lot better than Russell Wilson. So he's really fast too. He's a 96 speed. He's the first 100 I have, I have on my team, and I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to settle my Russell Wilson. So yeah, let's do some gameplay with uh, Michael Vick. Let's go into overdrive. All right, so here's some gameplay with Michael Vick. And we get plus one overall, so Michael Vick will be 101 overall in this. That's pretty cool. Okay. Oh man, Michael Vick is pretty fast. Oh, and he's broke that tackle. He's good. But yeah, he's really good. So make sure you guys get him. And after this, I'm going to show you guys how to um, actually get him in the garage sale and some tips that will help you uh, do that. Okay, so I spent a total of, I think, 800,000 coins trying to get Michael Vick. But most of it was just buying these packs, like in the store. So, here, I'll show you guys how I got him. So, what you need to do to get Michael Vick is... Oh, it doesn't let me click on it anymore. So, what you need to do is you're going to need 200, 20k um, tapes. So, what you'll have to do is you're going to have to go in the store every single day... And you should probably pay for, um, there's a 75,000 uh, coin pack in here that lets you get um, 1.5k Madden tape. And also this pack is really good too. It's because you're going to need a lot of tape for this. And to get tape, you can also do these achievements. So it'll give you a lot of tape over here. Just complete all the sets. Just complete three of these. These are really, really easy. All of these sets, really easy. And these ones are pretty easy too. The only hard part is buying the 85 overalls for this one. And definitely, if you don't already have them, then buying the 90 plus overalls for Michael Vick. Because oh, those aren't as bad as this. Because these ones need very, very specific um, cards from very specific teams. And right now in the auction house, you have to pay like 100k just to get one of them. So that's why I spent like 500k just getting that. And then once you have Michael Vick, you can put him on your team, of course. He's much better than any of the other ones, like Tom Brady. Tom Brady's horrible because he's really slow. Like he might be really good at like awareness and throwing and everything, but Michael Vick is fast and also has really good throwing accuracy. He should have all 90s. I'll show you. All above 90 right here. Everything is above 90 above 95 which is really good so yeah that's Michael Vick and he's also a big upgrade from like Russell Wilson if you have him if you want thinking about upgrading you should definitely do it because you can always sell Russell Wilson let's see how much Russell Wilson will sell for
Best Will's new one. Oh, I see. You can't buy him now. Yeah, there. So, right over here, he goes for, that's pretty good. He goes for like 750k bid, and people will actually bid for that. And you can put him at 1.2, 1.6 million. So, yeah, he sells, definitely. I just wouldn't put him at too high of a price, like some people over here are doing. But, yeah, you can definitely sell him and any of your other Team of the Year players. So that's it. Make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe and turn on notifications for more content like this.